Welcome to the WBC Arena. The time is now as we get set for what should be an incredible matchup. I'm Todd Grisham, and here with me, my broadcast colleague, it's Johnny Nelson. The pleasure's always mine, my friend. It's time now for our tale of the tape. In this corner, it's Saul Canelo Alvarez. He's 172 centimeters tall with a reach of 179. And in this corner, it's Sean. This is Canelo Alvarez, the Mexican legend, the middleweight, the super middleweight, the light heavyweight who fights out of Guadalajara, Mexico. Sean Showtime Porter, the two-time welterweight champion of the world, born in Ohio, but fighting out of Las Vegas, USA. You can hardly hear yourself speak. The fans are going mad for this. Well, the table is set. It's time to eat. Here we go. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. In the red corner, from Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico, here is Mexico's first ever undisputed world champion and renowned star of boxing, here is a four-division world champion and an undisputed super middleweight champion of the world, Saul Canelo Alvarez. Hiding out of the blue corner from Las Vegas, Nevada, by way of Northeast Ohio, here is a welterweight champion of the world, Showtime, Sean Porter. A lot of trash talk between these two fighters. Now it's time to put up or shut up. You can't beat a good old-fashioned rivalry. When there's guts, when there's feeling, when there's heart involved, that's when you get a good fight, one-on-one. -on -one. Good luck. High hopes for this battle between these two athletes. And he fails to score with that left hook. Missed him with that uppercut. defense here at all. And the referee may be called into What a shot that put him down. Would be wise here to take the full eight seconds. all of those big fight feels you want from a prize fight. Here we go. You see the nerves of the fight stepping into the ring tone. It can tell you so much about a fighter. And they're looking up as a corner. You've got one fighter that is in heaven. This is where they want to be. All the talk. Why would they try something that's... This is the biggest moment of his life. Can he seize it? Can he take control and put him out? And, that's it. and he goes down. Not looking good for him. So the round winding down now, and it's been another good one for him. advantage so far, Johnny, but kind of better. Here's the bell to start round two. Oh, those punches add up. Gotta be careful. The referee may take a point if he keeps clinching. Keep an eye on this slugger. As you know, he's willing to take three to give one. That's his game plan, and it's worked out pretty well for him so far. 
A win is not just a win for some fighters. They need to feel the blood, the crunch. They need to get that win. Shot lands. Some nice exchanges from both men in this round. He just misses with that big right hand. Uh oh, Porter is on wobbly legs. Porter just took a big shot and down he goes. Fighter relies a lot on their instincts. Final two seconds here, and this has not been his round for sure. Both fighters unwilling to engage in that round. A bit surprised. Just a little fight finder, that's all it was. Here we go in round three. Who's gonna land the first big shot? Stumbling around in potholes, in serious trouble. Oh, that changes everything, and down they go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You're out. So time to go celebrate after another knockout win here. There's no argument right there. Not, you say it. Night, night. <laughs>